Hey, hey, queens and kings. Welcome and welcome back. <sighs> Y'all look at this depressed room here to the point that I couldn't film none of this, any of this with you all. But I just want to give you guys an overview before I give you guys an update of the refresh room. I had to focus when I did this because Andre's stuff is everywhere as you all can see. Yes, I need him out my room. Yes stuff is everywhere i'm just trying to get back to the old me well not the old me the actually new me honestly i'm trying to get to that part there but um there's some changes need to be also made inside the home you know since there's so many other changes going on in my life so i needed to match you get what i'm saying but yeah <laughs> Anyways, Queens and Kings, so this portion of the video is sponsored for a collaboration with Yetta Home. I told you guys it was going to be another collaboration. But these here are some beautiful, beautiful storage ottomans that I actually love. More so because of the simple fact they actually have storage where I can have some of my junk at. But I told you guys in the last video that I was going to be pretty much looking forward to another collaboration with them. And honestly, I support this company. I really do support this company because anything that I have received from them have been in good top standards. Good quality, last long, easy to put together. You don't have to need a man for everything, honey, not everything. But what you guys have pretty much seen, a lot of things that I have got from them, I pretty much put it up by myself. But yeah um these are very affordable so click the links down below check them out they have several colors on their website of these that i'm pretty sure one of you queens and kings will actually love them too so you know check them out because i told you guys it was going to be more and there's actually more coming but yeah and all praise and glory go to god for that as well as you all too as well thank you guys so much for watching the video supporting me actually sharing leaving your comments a lot of you guys are very 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 supportive and i appreciate that because i need that in my life everyone actually needs that in their life but just to know that you have a support system on the internet that you have never met before that is mind-blowing that is mind-blowing so i guess my good heart is paying off <laughs> But anyways, queens and kings, as you all can see, these are so easy to put together. Easy to put together. But check out Yetta Homes. I promise you guys, you will not be disappointed. And I'll tell you guys a little bit more about these ornaments later in the video. Hey, Queens and Kings, I'm back. And I just want to give you guys an update of what I have done to the bedroom. Um, there's still little things that I want to critique, like over there in that corner. Um, probably even the wall where the TV is located at, because I think I told you guys in the last video that I did want to like swap the bed around. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm liking this so far, um, but there are other things that I want to critique in the room. I don't know. I'm going to sleep on it, though, before I do any more changes to it. But I just want to come on and show you guys pretty much what I have done 
and pretty much the update slash makeover, you would say, that I did. More like a refresh. I'm just saying more like a refresh. That's pretty much what I've done. Um, but yeah, let me start running my mouth and show you guys what I did, okay? All right, queens and kings. So we're pretty much going to start on this wall here where the TV is located at. And the first thing you notice that I do not have the big white vases there that I had the pompous grass in anymore. And by doing so, removing those, it opened up space in this area here. I'm still playing around with it. Uh, more so because of the simple fact of this little area here, like the seating area that I have now with my little bar cart. And then I brought the greenery here just to bring some life into the room and break up you know, some of the black, the purples and stuff like that. Just bring a little life, but also to hide the plugs that I do have over here, the cards and everything until I could probably do something different or something. I don't know, but I do just like this little area here. It's cute. It's cute. It's functional as well, but I just ain't got no alcohol in that donut yet. Just not just yet until I pretty much get Andre fully out of here. But you also see that I do have this storage ottoman here that came from Yetta Homes, which I do like that. So I'm able to hide decor and stuff like that. Even if I want to put some of my little night snacks in there, would I let him know? Yeah. So yes, I could be able to do things like that. You know, hide some of the little trinkets and stuff that I don't want to be seen out. Or when I want to sit over here, probably smoke my hookah or something like that, let the window up or whatever, and have, you know, all the charcoals or something in there. You know, just anything pretty much I could house into that ottoman there and i love it i really do love it i really do love it i probably just paint the legs on it silver because you know gold is not pretty much the thing in here but i don't know i'm gonna leave it like that though i'm gonna leave it like that so over here on the other side of the bed as you all can see this is the reason why i want him out of here look look won't let me be great won't let me be great at all i promise you i promise you you won't let me be great but yes that's pretty much that's over there is that crystal now for the bed itself it's simple it's plain but it does have a kick to it as and you see how i styled it with my um pretty much my tray and coasters and candles and you know stuff like that you know just to let you know okay it is girly it pretty much is girly and my bed i still use this white comforter i can't remember who i got this comforter from I really can't, but I know it's an Amazon find. I do know that. And then I got my little pillows there. Those are DIY pillows, the purple ones. And, you know, those are Amazon pillow covers there. So I like how this look. It's simple. It's not a lot going on. Just enough. And it just have all the colors that I pretty much want to do. So I'm about to knock stuff over. So anyways, now moving on over here to my vanity area. Yeah, you can see the struggler, right? You can see the struggler. You can see the struggler over here. Still playing around with it because I want to bring some greenery over here, but I got to figure out how I'm going to do that. And I think the only way I'm able to do that is if I probably pull the vanity over some more all the way over. I don't know. Just have to play around with it because I do want to start putting my makeup and stuff. And I want to use this wall here for like to put, hang up my um, palettes and things like that. You know, because I got to get some of the stuff out of the closet. So I got to utilize some more space. But I don't want it to look too cluttered. Definitely the vanity itself. So, yeah, I got to improvise some kind of way. But this is pretty much how to style as a right now. And then I use the other bar stool that I got from Yetta Homes. And I like this too as well because I can have some of my extra makeups and brushes and stuff in here. This is so cute. So, so cute. As you all can see. So, yeah. I, I like this ottoman. I really do like this ottoman. You also can change this ottoman over and just make it like a tabletop too as well. And that's the good thing about it also. So it's versatile. You know, you sit on it or make a table. But I have two of them, so I can actually always do that. You know, something that I don't have to go to the table or anything like that. Or just sit here to my vanity, y'all. Let's, let's be real. Let's be real about this situation. But I like these. I like the shade of gray. As you all can see, they are a, a velvet. And then it have these little gold legs and everything up on in the bottom. Easy to put together. It didn't take 30 minutes to do this, honestly. Unless you just want to watch TV like I was doing. Probably do take you 30 minutes then. But it was easy. One, two, three. And they together. They very sturdy, too. I did sit on them, you know, test them out and everything. So I do like these. I really do like these. So shout out to Yetta Home. 
for actually sending me these ottomans here. These are beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so one more area, as you all can see down here, is the rug. I was trying to figure out where I was going to put this rug at. I have it here for now because I need to actually lift up the dresser and put the rug up on it. But I'm just too lazy to move the stuff out of the way to do that. So right now, this is how I have it styled. I put the other picture frame over here. Um, I was just doing something to see how it would look. And I actually like the way that it looks. So that's the reason why I'm there. And I put the fan up here now. So it's not more of an eyesore. Because when I open the door, you can't see it. And honestly, it does blow better sitting right there. Because the vent coming down on it. So yeah, it make the room cooler and, and stuff like that. But anywho, I just have up here some books and things like that. Um, my beautiful candle holders here. And my bus. And you know, just some trinket stuff just to bring it out some. And I really do like how this area look slash the fan but hey we're keeping that fan there that fan ain't going on well but yeah queens and kings so this is pretty much the room how did it and i really do like it i like it i just like this color shade together this black anything with black scene i just be so luxe anything with black be so luxe to me so yeah that is the room y'all this is the update the refresh what do you queens and kings think about it do you like it do you like it let me know so yeah queens and kings that's pretty much just gonna be it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this refresh of the bedroom makeover update or whatever you want to call it because honestly i don't know what i'm gonna call it i don't know but i wanted to share with you all how it look because I really do like I'm glad that I stuck with the purple, went back to the purple other than the gold. Because like I said, I was going to have to go buy stuff. And it's like, I already had this stuff in storage. Why go spend money when you could just critique and you reuse and shop your home to actually give you the look that you want? So, who knows? You know, I'll swap some more other things around. Out, but anyways, that's going to be it, Queens and Kings. Remember, your crown may tip, but the damn show won't fall. Bye-bye.